What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Butters, and I'm back with another video now. Hope everybody had a great Christmas, bro. Everybody had a great Christmas, but we got some death battles, bro. You know what I'm saying? I know this is a little different from what's been going on on my channel. You know what I'm saying? But I'm still an anime guy. You know what I'm saying? We got Gogeta versus Vegito. Now, me personally, my personal favorite. I don't even know the difference. Wait, wait. Gogeta is Gogeta is the Broly movie? Bro, if y'all new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. We're on the road to 5K, bro. Hit that subscribe button right now. Right now. Let me know who y'all got in the comment section, bro. Oh, big shit, Ron. What is this madness? Whoa, Vegeta. Am I really that much taller than you? Stop it, Tagros. <laughs> Oh, that's fire. This is clean as hell. What the fuck is she clean as hell? Broly movie one. Broly is this one. Which one is this? Is this Vegito? I got Vegito. I got Vegito. Y'all let me let me know who y'all got in the comment section, bro. Let me make me a little smaller. Let me move the let me move the bag boy over a little bit. <laughs> Let's go, Vegito! Come on, Vegito. That bitch was hard. That bitch was hard. That, yeah, that bitch was hard. Yeah! Oh wait, hold on. It's some hold on. I I know I'm all tripping. There it is, my fault gang. Vegeta, what the fuck Gogeta start doing shit like that? Gogeta ain't never did no, bro, stuff like that only happened in Super. When it, when it was dealing with the GOAT, uh, the GOAT Black Goku, Goku Black. I mean... I mean, I guess it's, I guess it's shout out to Naruto because, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Naruto, Naruto, Naruto's so inspirational, bro. <laughs> Naruto's so inspirational. <laughs> He's so inspirational. He's so inspirational. When the, f y I know y'all tired of me stopping, but when the, when the, when, the, when has they ever been able to do that? Ever. Is that Super Saiyan 4? Hey, bro, I never seen Super Saiyan 4, bro. I didn't watch. I didn't watch GT. Or wherever Super Saiyan 4, that bitch cold as hell, right? Hey, clean! Yeah! Come on, Gogeta! No, Vegito! Which one am I going for? Vegito! Hard. I love how they go through all the different arenas that they've been through in the show. I love that. That's fire. 
That's fire. Turn niggas a stone. Since when was that a thing? When was that a thing? Power scalers. I need. I need to know. Incredibly close. No, seriously. How could it not be? They're almost exactly the same person. With a few minor differences here. Gogeta has more. All right. Let me lock in, bro. Let me lock in. More exclusive techniques equals skill. Fusion dance can. Film performance, shorter duration. Vegito considerably stronger by more. Uh, official sources longer uh, duration. No power matching required. Equal skill. You know what I'm saying? Unable to. Which one was I rooting for? Here and there, like signature attacks. Neither I was going for. Gogeta had one single power that provided an absolute edge over the other, except perhaps Vegito's longer time limit. It's not so I was going for Gogeta. Energy quick enough to end their fusions in less than ten minutes. Time isn't the only factor, but also whatever is maintaining each fusion. Gogeta's body and Vegito's earrings. It's possible. I was going for Gogeta. Yeah, because Gogeta is more of uh, Goku's character. Power can actually drain the Fatara faster than Gogeta's does his own body. Still, it's twice the time, and that definitely gave Vegeta more flexibility and strategy. So more often than not, it's safe to say Gogeta would run out of juice first. Also, when Vegeta or Gogeta diffuse from power overuse, it's typically difficult for them to immediately fuse again due to that lack of energy. But Vegeta had oh, another one over Gogeta. Uh, no Vegeta had a uh, Super Saiyan foe too. No matter what, he'd always have a very slight power advantage. Remember how the fusion dance requires the fusers to match their power levels? Well, the Patara don't need that. Goku doesn't need to match Vegeta's slightly lower power levels, so there's nothing stopping Vegeta from combining the full sum of their parts. Ah, poor Vegeta. You'll get your day in the sun one day, buddy. Ah, who am I kidding? This might be what Old Kai was referring to when he said the Patara had a greater effect. But hey, could Gogeta have destroyed the earrings? I'm calling rigged. He would have had to be able to overpower Vegito first. Like how Goku could only destroy Kefla's earrings after he reached Ultra Instinct. Remember, when comparing levels of power in Dragon Ball, the greater one can overrule almost anything the weaker one does. The earrings likely tend to be protected by the user's key aura, similar to their clothing. The only time we've ever seen Batara damage or specifically targeted are when the wearer is overwhelmed or in a vulnerable state. If any stray key blast could destroy them, we'd have a lot more broken earrings by now. Lastly, there's some debate over their personalities. In their first appearances, Vegito seemed rather cocky and playful against Boo, whereas Gogeta was far more deliberate against Janemba, and thus far more successful. However, these are not core personality traits, and assuming so would be inconsistent with Vegito's serious fight with Zamasu and Gogeta's more brash fights with Broly and Omega Shenron. Context is key. As far as personality and mental ability goes, Gogeta and Vegito are practically identical. 
In the end, Vegito's higher power level, no matter how slight it was, made a big difference in protecting and maintaining his longer, more flexible time limit. Gogeta was gonna need meta more than that to beat Vegito. Sorry, Wiz, I knew that pun was horrible. Wait, shut up. Earth's Dragon Balls give two wishes, right? Oh, yeah. Hey, Shinron, I wish for you to fuse me and win! <laughs> the winner is Vegito. That's bullshit. Gogeta should have fucking won, bro. That's bullshit, bro. That's bullshit, bro. If y'all enjoyed that video, hit that subscribe button, bro. Let me know what else y'all want me to react to, bro. I'm going to see y'all in the next one, bro.